Hello everyone, in this video we are solve a nice math problem which is x plus xy plus y is equal to 54 x minus y is equal to what? Here is x and y is positive integer. Here is x and y is positive integer. Now, how to solve this interesting math problem? So solution Here, our question, it will be x plus x, y plus y is equal to 54. Our target, x minus y is equal to what? So first of all, I can see really here is x is common. So this divide this, it will be 1 plus this divide this, it will be y plus y is equal to 54. Now, at this moment, I can see here is x times 1 plus y. And here, I add both sides 1. So, it will be y plus 1 is equal to 54 plus 1. I add both sides 1. Now, at this moment, you can see here x times 1 plus y. And here is 1 is common. So, it will be y plus 1 is equal to 54 plus 1 it will be 55 now at this moment look here is 1 plus y this is 1 plus y so both are same so i can see here is y plus 1 it will be common so it will be this it divide this it will be x and this divide this it will be plus 1 is equal to 55 now at this moment i can see this expression it will be x plus 1 times y plus 1 it will be 55 i solve this question step by step now we know that x and y is positive integer so you can see easily x is greater than or equal 1 also y is greater than also y is greater than uh, or equal 1 so you can see easily it will be greater than or equal 2 it is also greater than or equal 2 now here 55 this is 55 so at this moment we know that 55 it will be one multiplication 55 or 55 times one and also you can see that it is also uh, 11 times 5 and you can see that also it will be 5 times 11 so we'll find out here is four case but first of all you can see easily here x plus one is greater than equal to this is also greater than or equal to so this is this is equal to this so this is one but it is greater than or equal to so it is not possible and here 55 this is one it is also not possible it is not okay so this is okay this is possible because of that it is greater than or a by 2 it is greater than 2 also so i take this value and this value so i can see silly here our first case it will be x plus 1 times y plus 1 is equal to 11 times 5 so our first case so you can see silly here x plus 1 is equal to 11 and here y plus 1 is equal to 5 now at this moment you can see it will be x is equal to 11 minus 1 it will be 10 and here you can see y is equal to 5 minus 1 it will be 4 and others case or that here x plus 1 it will be 5 x minus y x plus 1 it is also 11 so i can see really here x plus 1 it is 5 in this case and other case here y plus 1 is equal to 11 now here x it is also 4 and here y it is 10 now our target x minus y is equal to what now at this moment you can see really here x plus y it will be x it will be 10 and y it will be 4 and you can see the x plus y it will be 14 
so we know that x and y is a positive integer so we are find out x plus y it will be 14 and in this expression it is also 14 because of that 10 plus 4 it is 14 so we'll find out here is x plus y it will be 14 but our question x minus y is equal to what this is our question now in this math problem you can see here we you know that we you know that a minus v whole square it will be a plus v whole square minus 4 a v now if i apply this formula we'll find out x minus v is equal to what so first of all our first equation our question it will be x plus x y plus y it will be 54 this is our question now in this case you can see this expression it will be x plus y plus x y is equal to 54 now recall we are find out x plus y it will be 14 so i put this value in this expression it will be 14 plus x y is equal to 54 now you can see really here x y it will be 54 minus 14 then you can see that it will be 40 so we are find out x and x y it will be 40 but our target x minus y is equal to what so we know that according to this formula we know that x minus y all to the power 2 it will be x plus y all to the power 2 minus 4 a v now in this expression we'll find out first of all x plus y it will be 14 so we know that here 14 is square x plus y minus 4 times x y x y it will be 14. now at this point you can see here x minus y whole to the power 2 is equal to 14 square it will be 196 minus and 4 times 40 it will be 0 4 times 4 it will be 60 16. so we are find out here is x minus y whole to the power 2 it will be 196 160 here is 6 and 19 minus it will be 3 so we'll find out x minus y it will be 36 so i use both side square root we know that x and y is positive integer so we'll find out here is positive value so it will be x minus y uh it will be plus minus 6 this is our final answer in this math problem Thank you all. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe my channel for other interesting video. Goodbye. Take care.